how you love me electric like you do love it how you love me electric always you love it how you love me electric electric i love it how you love me a lot love me a lot love me electric Hi Sagis, welcome to my channel. We're doing a reading. Yes, it's me. What you looking at? <laughs> it's like, is that really Sal? Yes, see, it's only me. It's just the only one in greatness. Okay, the one and only. Okay, how are you? Before we start, please check our new collection for Lord Ganesha together with the Lucky Elephants. Okay, for Feng Shui. Okay, so make sure you check it out. But by now, I know it's already sold out. Okay, well, the Green Adventure is already sold out. Out, excuse me for the elephants um for the lucky elephants but i know we have different collection for lord ganesh um over here so do check it out it is uh you know a removal of our obstacle um you know if you are you know if you do our you know say uh, certain rituals together with lord ganesh um it does remove obstacles in our life and also it helps us with our fears um, you know, because it removes that thing, you know, it makes our environment also very positive and joyous. Okay, so that's that. Um, so check that out. Um, let's see what's going on uh, with the lovers oracle. Ching, 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 ching. I don't know what that is. Okay, <laughs> let me see. Okay, I can't move much because I get dizzy. Okay, I get dizzy. Dizzy double B. <laughs> dizzy. DZ sa estrenta, no? Okay, here we go. Okay, my dad used to re listen to those um, station. Okay, and then there's this one person who's gonna say like good morning in a very very long way. I don't know what's his name. He goes like magandang 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 magandang, and then he goes like that so long. Okay, maganda means like me, maganda. <laughs> No, like, good morning. Okay. When it comes to matters of the heart, there is no right or wrong. Every choice you make expands your understanding of life and love. Okay. So you are not wrong for loving them. You are not wrong for trusting them. But what did your mom say? <laughs> it is wrong. It is wrong. It is wrong. <laughs> now, I think you're just learning how to be in love or to be in a relationship. That there is no mistake. It's just the understanding that is being learned here. You know, every relationship that we ha we encounter, it's actually helping us progress. It's helping us um, become better. That's that. Love that. Okay. Now, let's see the other oracle. Mm -hmm. So you're progressing the way that you love, Sag. Love it. Keep it up. Okay. Okay. So there's never, no, there's no right or wrong. Goddess of the moon, yin and yang. Okay, so if you connect with a twin, that's my twin card, yin and yang. Okay, you're trying to understand them. You're trying to understand your feelings between each other. The moon has some harshness. You know that uh, it depends on the shape of the moon. If it's crescent, it's called, you know, the horns. So the more that it's uh, crescent, the more that... Um, let's just say um, relationship or not relationship um, the way that communication or mind can uh, can hurt other people um, you know the more crescent shape it is okay but it depends on a chart okay so the yin yang over here just symbolizes that the two of you have been going around in circles for quite some time and it involves about someone um, opening up their heart chakra to you so they're very very in love Okay, or you are in love, but it's just a cycle of like who opens up, when are they going to open up, and you're trying to understand them. Okay, 
So let's see what's going on here. Uh -huh. dun, dun, dun. Oh yes, if you're looking at it, I do my own hair, okay. Salon de Manila, thank you. Salon de Manila. <laughs> do we still have Salon de Manila? We don't know, okay. What is it now? Bench fix. Okay, here we go. Let's see. You have King of Swords. Mm -hmm. Sag. The Divine Feminine had this as their first card. So you're as Jupiter is in Aquarius right now. So there's a lot of things that you have been thinking about and it involves expansion of your mind, expansion of your dreams, goals that you're setting for yourself. Yep, definitely you are goal-oriented. Look at that, the Three of Wands. The Three of Wands is optimistic. You want to move, you want to relocate. You're feeling challenged right now by the universe and you're up for the challenge. It feels like you're just waiting for some sort of a go signal. So the Three of Wands is just waiting at the pier, okay? This is a sun in Aries also. Um, you want to take charge of your life right now and you feel like this is the time for myself. This is where I make, uh, uh, how to say this, not make a mountain out of a molehill. <laughs> you know, you're not making a problem. Um, you're overcoming problems and you're creating some sort of change in your life, which is an empress. You want to bring in more abundance. Mm -hmm. You're going to bring in more abundance. The, the thing with the Sag is like, I know you guys work hard, but because your second house lord, which is Saturn, which is for your savings, then in order for you to gain money, it really requires a lot of effort. The only good thing with you is that you're optimistic. So you don't care about hard work because you're naturally lucky. And then Saturn guarantees that you have finances, um, you know, which is good. Especially right now, Saturn is in Capricorn. Then money is always going to be there. But it's money to be kept, not to be let go okay? and to be control controlled. Um, with Saturn in your second house, I do say DRL Vedic Astrology, not Western, okay? Um, this is all about taking care of the family also, being responsible for the people who have supported you. So you might be doing um, outreach, you're helping other people. This is If you do this, it's going to be very, very good for your karma. So try to do that. Um, abundance will come to you. Saturn will gu guarantee that you will get what you deserve, which is good. So if you work hard and you, you give it to others, then more and more comes to you. Um, you know, it may look like a curse for some because that's how I look at it. When you give, let's just say, you give you give a million and then you get one billion. Does that even do justice, right? So for you, it's like the more you give, the more you're going to receive. Okay, this is what it is. Queen of Cups right here. Um, see, that, that's why when you know your chart, you know how it's placed. It's it's easy to work with the universe, you know, instead of going against it. Yes, exactly. Okay. Um, uh, it looks like here, your, your envelope in love, you're really realizing that love for me is real and I do deserve this. Okay. I don't sense much of a person here right now. Okay, I don't sense them. You're just the Queen of Cups. Now, the Two of Coins is a part of you that needs to make a decision right now. Um, this is not them being in limbo. This is you. Whether you're going to choose yourself over them. You got a Six of Wands. You could be successful and famous with what you do. There will be a travel or a relocation with work or a work and then relocate. You know, you know like that. Uh -huh. And it's going to be good for you. Um, a promise to buy a home is here. So this is going to be a nice home also that you're purchasing. You're going to get it. If you're waiting for a loan, a grant, it's going to come to you also. Ten of Wands is how you, you know, your success is not connected to the other person's success. If you're connecting with a twin, they're surrendering on their life, on their end, as far as like they're giving up. I'm not sure they're giving up on you. They're giving up on themselves. But they feel that they're just so tired. Okay, they're very, very tired. Okay. You have the Knight of Wands and the Queen of Cups. Um, that's you. I feel like you're always, you're the one who always makes them feel good about themselves when they're feeling low. Just like apple bottom jeans, boots with the fur. Low, 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 low. Yes, okay. 
with the Knight of Wands and the Ten of Wands, you're a cheer me up kind of person. This is what you do to them. Okay. So this person can be a Debbie Downer at some, at some days. You get a Temperance with the Two of Pentacles. So you haven't given up on them. So you're going to consider to make it work. You being patient and gorgeous right there as a Sag. Your wisdom to this person helps them, you know. This is a person who I, who sees you, who uh, who sees you as someone who is more than they can ever have. Mm -hmm. Like, if it is in a great song, upgrade, upgrade, you know. You turn their odumapage, okay. So you give them that AG, okay, <laughs> upgrade. You got an eight of coins and the six of wands. Um, you are very responsible. You're a person who knows how to be successful. You're on top of your game here. Um, I see that nothing's gonna stop you from your dreams. I see here nothing's gonna stop you from being able to accomplish big things in your life. Um, and you're just focused on you. Now the other person, I don't really see them. Ace of Wands with the Ten of Wands. They want to have a new beginning with you. This can be the same person. It's not a new person, I don't think so. They want to be with you in this, what we call your life journey. Three of Wands to the Ace of Wands to be as a partner. They want to be that person that completes you, that addition to your life. And then the Wheel of Fortune, which is your last card, which is your card also. Something is going to go in your favor with a person who you probably have let go. Something is about to turn around with your twin. Something that you probably thought will never happen is about to manifest. I'm going to continue this reading. Link down there in the description box below. We'll see what is this big thing that's about to turn around. Thank you very much, guys, for watching. Have a wonderful, wonderful day. Make sure to check out all the amazing things at eatreadlove.me, the number one shop. Sh the, the number one shop. The, the, you know what? It's a shop, okay? Go shop. I cannot pronounce it. Okay, I'm getting distracted by the air. Okay. Thank you very much, guys, for watching. Bye.